Hello and welcome to 2 Minute nice Design, glasses. I'm Dage and today we're gonna highlight a road on a map in Photoshop. I have exported this high resolution map as a JPEG from Google Earth Pro. If you don't know how to do that, go ahead and Google it. I'm not gonna create a 2 Minute Google Earth Pro channel just for that. So I'll drag this map and drop it into Photoshop to open it. Now I think it's too dark and desaturated, so let's fix that. In the layers panel, click this button to add an adjustment layer, choose levels, and then in the properties panel, drag the white input slider to the left. Let's add another adjustment layer, and this time we'll choose Vibrance. In the properties panel, increase the Vibrance slider to around 90. It all depends on the photo you're working on, so we may need to adjust these values accordingly. Great, now let's draw a line that follows this road here. So activate the pen tool from the tools panel and up here in the options bar, make sure shape is selected from this drop down menu, set the fill color to none, set the stroke color to red, open this drop down menu and set the alignment to center and finally you can adjust the stroke width or thickness. I will set it to 15 pixels because it will work well with my image size. I will click outside the map, move the cursor, and then click and drag to create a curve. Move the cursor, click and drag to create another curve, move the cursor, click and drag, and finally click once to set the end point. You can hold down Alt if you're on Windows or Option if you're on a Mac to move these handles and adjust the curve. Cool. Now let's add a small circle here. Click and hold on the shape tools and activate the ellipse tool. In the options bar, make sure new layer is selected here. Now click and drag to create the circle and do that while holding down the shift key in order to create a perfect circle. Up here in the options bar, let's set the fill color to red, the stroke color to white and you can decrease the stroke width a little bit. With the move tool, you can adjust the position of the circle. Let's add a small caption. Click and hold on the ellipse tool and activate the rectangle tool. Create a rectangle here and it will have the same fill and stroke colors as the circle. Finally, activate the horizontal type tool, click once and type hotel. You might need to adjust the font size here on the options bar. And let's move our text with the move tool and align it correctly with the rectangle. Now that I know where the hotel is, I'm going there. Bye bye!